Hello, welcome to Event Update on AAU TV, the voice of higher education in Africa. Event Update is the number one stop show that brings you upcoming higher education events happening in Africa. I am Isabella Tetanhinakwa, and I have here with me Alexandra Johnson to do the French version of the Event Update. Please stay tuned, we'll be right back. The University of Khartoum is the oldest university in Sudan. It has a lot of faculties, and this includes the science faculty. The science faculty has a lot of facilities and among them is the Microbial Culture Collection Unit, MCCU. The MCCU has two subunits, namely the Molecular Biology and the Microbiology Units. The Microbiology Unit consists of the Culture Room and the Microbiology Lab. The Microbiology Lab is well equipped with state-of-the-art facilities to conduct analysis on bacteria and other microbes. The bacteria are then sent to the culture room for incubation based on two temperatures, that is the cold and the room temperature. There is also a freeze dryer that converts bacteria into powdery forms to be stored over time. The molecular biology unit is where DNAs are extracted using equipment such as microwaves. Other facilities of the unit include the sterilization room where all equipment used in the unit are sterilized. It is also where the microbes used in the various experiments are killed. A cold room where samples such as DNA and media are kept as well as a meeting room where seminars and experiments are done. Welcome back. The Strategic Purchasing Africa Resources Centre, SPAC, is hosting an open access symposium in collaboration with the University of Cape Town Libraries and other sister institutions libraries in the Western Cape, among others. Theme, Open Access and Social Justice Driving African Development. Date, Monday 2nd to Friday 6th December 2019, venue, Lab at Cape Town in South Africa. Speakers for the event include Joe Glassen, Manager of Scholarly Communication and Research at UCT Libraries, Caroline Inkube, a professor in the Department of Commercial Law at UCT, and Joshua Netfox, the Coordinator for Digital Publishing at the Wayne State University Libraries in Detroit at USA, among others. This will be a week of workshop engagement and invited papers for critical discourse to advance African open scholarship within a social justice this paradigm. For more details, please contact Lina Nyahoja via lina.nyahoja at uct.ac.za or call plus 272-165-05469. Le Centre de ressources pour les achats stratégiques en Afrique Spark organise un colloque sur le libre accès en collaboration avec les bibliothèques de l'Université du Cap UCT et d'autres bibliothèques d'institutions sœurs dans le Western Cape, la SAF et Wakren entre autres du 2 au 6 décembre 2019 à Itemba Lab à Cape Town en Afrique du Sud. Le thème de cet atelier est le libre accès et la justice sociale au cœur du développement de l'Afrique et les conférenciers pour l'événement comprennent Gilles Klassen, responsable de la communication scientifique et de la recherche aux bibliothèques de l'UCT. Caroline Nkoubé, professeure au département de droit commercial de l'UCT et Joshua Netfox qui est leur coordinateur pour l'édition numérique aux bibliothèques de la Wayne State University à Détroit aux états unis entre autres. Ce sera une semaine d'ateliers de communication et il y aura une discussion critique pour faire avancer la recherche ouverte africaine dans un paradigme de justice sociale. Pour plus d'informations, contactez Lena Nyahoja via lena.nyahoja.uct.ac.za ou appelez le plus 272 16 50 54 69. The Multidisciplinary Research Center of Excellence, MRCE, at Asyut University in Egypt is organizing the third international conference on multidisciplinary research, third ICMR 2020. Date, 20th to 23rd March 2020. Venue, Hawaii Kaiser Palace Resort, Hergada in Egypt. Expected participants, researchers, academics and industrial people among others. You are all invited to join the Asiut University for this conference and you can submit your abstract latest by 25th December 2019. For more information about the third ICMR 2020, kindly contact plus 208-820-80209 or email mrce at aun.edu.eg. 
le Centre d'excellence en recherche multidisciplinaire MRCE de l'Université d'Assut organise la troisième conférence internationale sur la recherche multidisciplinaire du 20 au 23 mars 2020 à Hawaii, Kaiser Palace. Les chercheurs universitaires et industriels, entre autres, sont tous invités à rejoindre l'Université d'Assut pour cette conférence. Et pour ceux qui veulent soumettre leur résumé, vous pouvez le faire au plus tard le 25 décembre 2019. Pour plus d'informations sur la troisième ICMR 2020, veuillez contacter plus au 208 82 08 02 09 ou envoyer un courriel à mrce.aun.edu.eg. One of the universities set up in our pre-independence era, the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology. Our international reputation has and continues to soar as a reference point in matters of science and technology, research and education. We believe that the future belongs to those who have sound technology acumen. I love USD. I love KNUS. <laughs> <laughs> The Association of African Universities and the Lower Open University College is organizing the SIP General Assembly and Conference on the African Council for Distance Education. Theme, Open and Distance Learning, the Continental Education Strategy for Africa and the Sustainable Development Goal 4. Date, 24th to 27th March 2020. Venue, Association of African University Secretaries in Accra, Ghana. Every four years, the ACDE organizes its general assembly and conference to take stock of its activities in the last four years and also to plan for the next four years. Expected participants, scholars, policymakers, professionals, students, and other stakeholders. You can also send your original research abstracts, case studies, and proposal formatted according to the conference guidelines. For more information, please visit www.aau.org. L'Association des universités africaines et le Collège universitaire au vert de Laoué organisent la 6e Assemblée générale et la conférence sur le Conseil africain pour l'enseignement à distance sous le thème « Apprentissage ouvert et à distance ». La stratégie continentale d'éducation pour l'Afrique et l'objectif de développement durable 4 date 24 au 27 mars 2020, lieu secrétariat de l'Association des universités africaines à Accra au Ghana. La CDE organise tous les quatre ans son Assemblée Générale et sa conférence pour faire le point sur ses activités des quatre dernières années et planifier ses activités pour les quatre prochaines années. Participants attendus, chercheurs, décideurs, professionnels, étudiants et autres parties prenantes. Vous pouvez également envoyer vos résumés de recherche originaux, vos études de cas et vos propositions dans un format conforme aux directives de la conférence. Pour plus d'informations, veuillez visiter www.aau.org. The Global Institute for Transformative Education and the School Project Foundation, in conjunction with the University of Cape Coast, UCC, are organizing a World Conference on Transformative Education, WCTE, in Cape Coast, Ghana. Date, 29th to 31st July 2020. Theme, The Future of Africa and the Role of Transformative Education. The conference seeks to chart new avenues for Africa's enduring development through education. Expected participants include higher education practitioners, scholars, researchers, policymakers, engineers, publishers, librarians, and school administrators, among others. The deadline for call for proposal is Tuesday, 31st December 2019. For further information, please visit www.gite.education slash events slash submit underscore proposal. L'Institut mondial pour l'éducation transformatrice et la School Project Foundation, en collaboration avec l'Université de Cape Coast UCC, organise une conférence mondiale sur l'éducation transformatrice WCTE à Cape Coast au Ghana du 19 au 31 juillet 2020. Thème l'avenir de l'Afrique et le rôle de l'éducation transformatrice. La conférence cherche à tracer de nouvelles voies pour le développement durable de l'Afrique par l'éducation et les participants attendus incluent tout praticien de l'enseignement supérieur 
professeurs universitaires, chercheurs, décideurs, ingénieurs, éditeurs, bibliothécaires et administrateurs d'écoles, entre autres. Pour plus d'informations, veuillez visiter wwwjiteducation bar events bar submit ba proposar bar That is all for this episode. Events update is brought to you by the Association of African Universities. Please subscribe to our social media handles on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter at AAU underscore TV. I am Isabella Tetahinakwa. And I am Alexandra Ampaba Johnson. And we are looking beautiful in our fabric sponsored by GTP Textile Ghana. See you same time next week. Bye.